<laughs> so I'm joining a free walking tour with Christoph. 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 What? Yeah. I'm creating a bar. Oh. Yeah. Free walking tour with Christoph. Yeah. And the rest of the people here. It's a big group. It's a big group, yeah. It's 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 very it's Soviet. Very yeah. Soviet and yeah. it's very deep. The subway yeah, yeah. is very deep. But the uh, Matt he told me about the the My guy. of the houses because the first floors they've been changed a lot mm. there's this business oh, okay. thing there's this like a restaurant we're going inside a typical georgia neighborhood Social media from the old time that we are with gossip, that we are with this, this politics, and all of it. And I love this, but people find it here, it wasn't like this. So they were like, it's definitely more communal than. Uh, yeah, yeah, the, I, 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 I'm surprised it's really big inside. Yeah. Yeah, but usually, like, this, when you look at a map, like, the streets are like, oh, yeah, really, yeah. Far, really far, far apart because you have these huge, huge foreground. So yeah, yeah. With the grapes, I mean, yeah, it's, it's we don't have grape vineyard in the Philippines, so <laughs> and oh. seeing this just at the backyard is just really amazing. Yeah, but they're probably not a good. Uh, like, but certain. you can eat it, right? You can probably eat it, but this one? Like, they have five hundred fifty different types of grapes in Georgia. here. Yeah, in Georgia, fifty types of grapes in five, Georgia. Five hundred fifty. Five hundred fifty. Yeah. Christ. And 470 of them you can drink, you can make wine from. Oh! You can actually, there's a, the, the place called Samuri, yeah. the bar. They have one that is like all 470. Wow. Mixed. It's, it's not very good. Uh, they are gathering some metal all the time. So like all refrigerators and ACs and they are recycling them. And that's what they are using this car. Because they are so strong. I don't think it's the only good thing. I really like this cafe. Like, it's <laughs> yeah. I really like how it's being set up. Like, you know. It looks really cozy. Yeah, very cozy. If you're gonna take a picture outside, you think that it's actually inside. What? If you're gonna take a picture of it and you're gonna look at it, um, other people who, who, don't, who doesn't know about this, they feel they will be able to see. They, they will be able to like. They won't be able to know that it's actually outside, but it's. Yeah, yeah. It looks like it's like a. a yeah. Inside a... I mean, look at that dog. It's, it's really old. Like it's. Yeah. Like that wood must be. Like really, really old. Do you think it will still? It still can carry people. 
Yeah, I think they're actually and, and, and people who are partying and like, who, who? Oh, yeah, I don't think you want to party <laughs> on that one. But I think like these, uh, even though it's like on a... On yeah, a this one. I can't remember what they're called in the... For some reason they're called the Knick in Danish, which is like a boy. Uh, yeah. So... But uh, they can hold an insane amount of weight. That one is I'm, so I'm slow. about these like flat, flat bottoms. Yeah. And like that one. This one is just like a theater or yeah, whatever. Cats yeah. Just walking around, and they're like their own people. They just uh, we had a one. And the dog are like so big. Yeah, they're, yeah. they're stray dogs. It's, oh, it's only it's only large dogs, almost. Yeah. Medium size are large dogs. It's almost the same like when I was in in Montenegro and in Turkey. Yeah. The stray dogs are so big. But are, are they treated as nice? Yeah, because they have like a tag on their ears. Yeah. So I think they, they are, them. yeah. Not exactly the same, I mean, it's another, but... Uh, but it's a queen house. Because Alexandra Javatiani had not one, but two sons. So, so he built this house for both of them. Um, I guess he wanted both.
like really nice. This is the initials that she was talking yeah, about, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. Really yeah. Your, your old houses yeah, yeah. that brother, represent my, my Denmark brother's, really? My brother's apartment is older than the uh, United States. Oh, okay. So, so we have we have some pretty old houses, but that's like that's in the middle of Copenhagen and it's a, it's a really old apartment. Uh, the floor is so slanted that you, if you put like a pencil it's gonna roll. <laughs> so uh, yeah, but that's like that's really really hard to fix anything in because you have to follow the rules. The way the staircase is made is it even to make um, and you can also after date someone in your neighbors won't be able to see. Tip look out for guys And the laundry game is strong. <laughs> this is another very typical old Lucy courtyard. Uh, this house, actually there's two houses, they used to be separate, but you know, things are better. They made sure that everyone was closer to each other. But it kind of worked out pretty well in modern day. I don't know if anyone is... Actually, something I really appreciate in Copenhagen too is like this heritage in terms of our buildings. Yeah. Maybe like part of the town has really like a, a vibe to it. Mm. And uh, it's really the same with Lisi. So you can still see a lot of, of old houses in Copenhagen? Yeah, yeah. Cool. They've kept a lot of it. I mean, in the Philippines, there's just a specific places where you can actually yeah. see old houses because most of it were actually. Um, burned yeah. or in fire during World yeah. War Two. Yeah, I think a lot of a lot of the Copenhagen, Copenhagen buildings were also lost to fires and uh, bombing by the fucking British. <laughs> mm, that was fair. We didn't put up any fight against the Nazis. This wood are scary. Like I don't know if it still can hold people. I think, like, don't underestimate like the, the strength of wood. Oh, you know, like in the big, we talked about hydro, hydro energy before. Yeah, yeah. They use a specific type of wood because it lasts way longer than metal. Yeah, this uh, is that's, that's the this is beautiful. Oh yeah, the staircase is insane. That is the coolest fucking staircase. Yeah. I have to show that to my brother. It's a good investment. Yeah. <laughs> And there's not that many of them left. You can so buy like... Do you want me to ask? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's how it works. Uh, in the very beginning of this walking tour, we used to take pictures on that staircases. We don't do this anymore because you remember we love our tourists alive. Mm -hmm. So, let's go out and find a better place and safer place to take our group pictures. But first, let's find a baby. And it was covered with coins. In early 19th century, several thousand of German people from Schwab and Schwab and Wigan, and I pronounce it. <laughs>
this type of like uh, building that's very common in Copenhagen. Common in? Yeah, in Copenhagen. Ah, uh, Copenhagen. Yeah, it's like, uh, I don't know what to call them. Rose and the... This one? Yeah, like, uh, like that. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, like this, like this. Ah, this one. Yeah, there's like, like this could be like this could be like building. Kind of looks like my apartment area. We usually have stairs. Into, uh, no, I mean this 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 kind of building is already like new. Oh yeah. The yeah. The buildings, because the the one that we had a while ago were just like the the really old buildings of Tivoli. Yeah, this could be in Copenhagen, like ah, okay. easily. Some of the older buildings also has have this nice ornamentation, yeah. but uh, it's too expensive to make now nowadays. The craftsmen are gone because the wages are too high. of uh, 20th century Georgia, uh, Zurab Tsaratelli. I don't love him because he's also pro-Russian. I mean, he's huge. His cultures, they are on the... One of the church they even built a prison like around it and then they built a house around it so now it's not a functioning church it's still a house but as more of a history we had it but of course georgian orthodox church as an institution was not So we are now actually at the more posh location here in Tbilisi, totally different from where we started. So I think this is a good thing. We're able to see the the progression. I don't know if we're gonna, I'm saying it the right thing, but from old Tbilisi and then here, it's like new buildings being built, but that's what the, Tamar, what's her name? Tamar? Yeah. Tamara said um, she felt like she doesn't want to be ungrateful, but she felt like this place is what did you say? What did she mention? Artificial. Artificial. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's very yeah. It's, it's, uh, even though they have tried to keep like, like historical context there, yeah. it's just it's too, too 
like too like clean and like no small cracks or anything. It's yeah, like, yeah. It's, like it's, it's too nice. It's just too perfect. Yeah, it's too perfect. <laughs> Enough. Yeah. It just feels like more like a mall, I think. Yeah, she said that it's more like um, these are being rented as Airbnb. Yeah. Well, but it feels like an outlet that I went to in Italy. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, it really does. Which part of Italy? I can't remember. It was a long time ago. <laughs> was northern Italy. But it's beautiful here. But this place is more like um, the, the Arabian side. That's why she said yeah. if you want to eat um, yeah, like Turkish, Turkish yeah, 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 yeah. Lebanese, yeah. Iranian. So you can find the best Arab food here. But she said it's very rare. You can find very good Georgian food. I really like that bench design. Yeah, it is it's, cool. It's really cool. Flowing. Useful art. I like that. Well, the, the, my, my Russian friends that I met along the way with all my travels are very understanding of what people are really saying about their country and even them. But um, they don't get offended because they feel yeah. the same way they said. Yeah, yeah. I think but the Italian people live in, I mean, unlike Germans, because you remember I mentioned that usually the entrances of 19th century Felicity houses, I want to stand somewhere for a uh, in the entrances of uh, 19th century Tbilisi houses, they were usually beautifully painted and in the entrance, they had different welcoming walls. And usually it was salve because most of the decorators, they've been Italian. So why not put Italian words there, they thought? And salve became one of the most common words in the 19th century Tbilisi entrances. I like her. I'm very like... Uh... Very energetic, yeah. yeah. Really a good guy, like, yeah, very good guy. I would definitely not be able to do anything close to that. <laughs> I'm pretty good at presenting, but this is like insane. Yeah. So you have vinyl? Yeah. You're collecting it? Yeah, a little bit. I have, I also just have some like crazy weird music that I buy for like no money. Uh, and then I have a few of like the stuff that I listen to a lot. How do I have like uh, uh, jazzy, like a... Uh,
Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Saxophone. I have another trumpet music. It's nice. Like, uh, you know Kurt Albert? No. Uh, it's like his old, like, old parents, like, time, maybe. These are like old and rustic. Yeah, I wonder what. It looks like it's brass, so it's probably still fine to drink from. Yeah. That's copper. That's like it's even deeper time to take once it starts uh, rusting. Yeah, I'm going to go to the fish. Fish. What? I could land some grass. Just like yeah. relax a bit. But it's been like. It's I want to buy just, something like this. Like that? Like a tote yeah, bag? Yeah, because it's yeah. yeah, hand painted and it's yeah. really like original Georgian yeah, very, thing. Very original, yeah. Yeah. That's work. Because I don't want to buy anything that's made in China or something. No, no, no. Yeah. 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 We are not using them on a daily basis. We are not drinking out of them while meeting with friends. But in a bigger traditional Georgian celebration, we can still drink out of them. And those are normal size ones, but this one. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna get one of these. At least, and these like, are really. These are like yeah, these are like original orange, right? Yeah, yeah. Probably going to throw more money. <laughs> yeah, we'll see what it costs. We'll see how, how yeah. 
just gonna say how much it costs. Go lower once, and then if they say no, I'll leave. And then maybe they'll call you back. Yeah. You have to be pretty tough and not care about their feelings. Because hmm. it's like, yeah, it's a game. But it's very rarely you get to battle because it's usually pretty rude. Yeah. I like the paintings here. Yeah. I think there's a lot of my paintings. Yeah. It's just hard to bring home. I think I, I think there are paintings that you can just can you call you, you can roll, yeah? Yeah. Like you can get them off the Yeah, you can get it off the from the board. Yeah. This is the this Stalin is like my, my, my Russian friends talk about them really shitty things. Like Stalin? Yeah, yeah. they don't like him. No, Stalin was literally just a terrible human being. Like yeah, he yeah. Really evil. Yeah, that was, that's evil. what my, my Russian friends are telling me about. Like, do you know Stalin? No. Okay, read about him because it's like evil. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> did, did I tell you like uh, when, he, uh, when his son tried to kill himself? Is a big flea market. Like I think the entire the entire island is a flea market. Yeah. Yeah. This is cool. Yeah. Really cool. <laughs> okay, I have a tour. No, there are some new things. Every time I'm coming here, there's new things. So Christoph, this is the dry bridge just talking about. The one that was being created by an Italian architect. Yeah. It used to be over water. It used to be. Yeah. Then they they moved the river. Yeah. Oh yeah, this park is pretty close too.
It's the end of our walking tour. I had fun. You had fun? Yeah, it was really nice. Yeah, Tamar, who's our guide. Yeah, who's our guide for today. She's the best. She's very energetic. She's very knowledgeable. So if you will be here in or traveling to Georgia in Tbilisi, you book a you book the free walking tour and look for Tamar because she's just awesome.